April 23rd, 1989. Once again, we are back in Hotline Miami 2. We are Richter, still, the one who killed Jacket, or at least put him in the hospital. I can't remember if he actually killed him or not. Um, so we're talking to our mom. She's sick, cold, and dying for some reason. Don't know why. Are you going out again? You, you, you'd you tell me if you got involved in some kind of trouble, right? Don't worry, Mom. Just going to the bar to meet up with a friend. Did she fight, answer a phone call and I just don't know about it? Oh, that's lovely, dear. I was afraid that you were a bit of a loner, like your dad. Maybe you could invite your friend over for a cup of tea sometime. Maybe she is British. Who knows? It's been an awful... It's been awful long... It's been awful long since we had any guests. Oh. Yeah, maybe. Alright, bye, Mom. We're gonna go murder some people with our friend at the bar. You've got one new message. Hi there, it's Dan from Bush and Flower? Bush of Flower? Bush and Flower? I don't know. We've got some gardening work for you uptown. A nice old house on Northwest 66th Street. Shouldn't be too hard to find. I'm just waiting for them to call and just he's just gonna be like, wait, that's my address, and then go upstairs and there's just a bunch of Russians up there for no reason. Or his mom has like a gun and a dagger, and she's like the hardest boss in the entire game. It's pretty straightforward. You'll know what to do. Just put on your suit, just put your suit on and get going. Click. Alright, time to do some gardening, I guess. Once again, the crappy dirty bus. Is it getting more dirty, or is that just my imagination? Probably just my imagination, but who knows. 19th scene, house call. We're a doctor. Don't worry, it's the police. We're here to answer. Oh jeez, oh jeez, that's my gun. He had one bullet left, of course. Because he spent an entire clip on us. All right, nailed him. And mom said I- oh gosh, she got from attack from behind. Uh, I don't know what mom said, anyways. Gosh, sometimes I just forget what I'm doing. And then, bam! Alright. Now I need to grab this gun. Get eaten by a dog. I really need to figure out what I'm doing here with that dog. Because he's- oh gosh, why? Why, what happened? He's the only thing that's been killing me. And then, bam! And... Where? From my right, maybe? I don't know. Oh, well. Uh, we're gonna teleport through the wall, of course. Because we are that person. Uh, oh, there's a dog over here. So we need to wait for him to come into sight. And there's the shotgun guy. Okay, he's the one that killed us just then. Why did I just throw my gun at him? Who knows? Because I enjoy dying. Alright. And then... Bam, and bam, of course. And we're dead. <laughs> what else would I be doing other than dying? Alright. Uh, yuck! And by yuck, I meant... Whatever. Words are hard. Um... Let's wait for the dog to come around. Bam. And then steady up a shot and shoot the dog that's coming at us. Like I said, steady up a shot, shoot that guy. And then we'll go around, shoot that guy, and... Which direction do I want to head? This way? Yeah, probably. Let's go this way, shoot that guy. Get ready for the bathroom. There we go. Oh, gosh. Uh, close the bathroom door. There's a lot going on up here, but I think we can handle it. Let's go. Bat. Anyone else want to have a have a go? These guys do. And then there's a the shotgun guy around the corner, who we miss wildly. There we go. Floor cleared. Now we need to find an automatic gun, maybe? This one? That looks good. Let's go. Bat. Nope, not what we want to do. Alright, so the... <laughs> There's a ton of stuff happening here, but we don't want to be involved in any of it, so we're just going to hide there for a while. Um, can I make it around the corner without dying? Probably not. Nope. <laughs> oh, what? 
Pardon me, dog. When did you become Miss Kitty Pride? You're a dog, so isn't that kind of against your nature to be a cat? Alright, we sprayed and prayed. Probably hit the big guy with any luck. Um, gonna do a bit more spray and pray right now. Which we didn't pray hard enough, apparently. Because we missed. Uh, now what? Maybe I do a little bit of this and a little bit of shooting me in the face. Alright, a little bit more spray and pray, and now we're empty. Oh boy. Um, maybe we can. Dang, there's just no hiding from that guy. We have to have a gun to get in there. Alright. Ah, man. Okay, there we go. Finally got into this room, just in time to not have a gun. Oh, there's a gun. Nope, it's empty. Uh, <laughs> so hopefully he's stuck down there. Man, freaking doors. They always get me. Butts. Okay. Okay. Now it's time for me to not die, and to get... Why? I just want to shoot one bullet at a time, but it doesn't seem to want to let me do that. Okay, here we go. We're getting that guy. He's going to bleed out. We're out of bullets, but... Uh, see if we can punch this guy through the window. Nope. We cannot, but we can get killed. But we already knew that. But we can do this. Lucky us. Now we have a shotgun. And now we can go... We didn't attract that guy, apparently. Um, we're going to shotgun this guy. Wait for the big guy to come around to a visible place and miss him. <laughs> Got him that time, though. Why? I cannot... I always lose my cursor right after I unlock. Which is the worst. But at least I do remember to unlock sometimes. Which is kind of rare, I guess. But every once in a while, I remember to unlock so I don't die instantly. Okay. We're going to run up here, get this guy, and get shot. Of course. What else would we be doing? <laughs> sometimes I don't like getting shot. But other times, it's fine. This is one of those times where I'd rather not be being shot. Be being shot? Sure. Come on, come around the corner. Your head is mine. Come on, shoot better. There we go. Now, looks like just a bunch of melee guys and they're having some fun in here kicking around that ball. Okay, <clears throat> we only have eight bullets left. So this is gonna be tough. At least we can get that guy. Oh, boy. Um, oh, there's another gunman. We need to take him out with a gun, hopefully. Actually, we're going to go grab his gun. Because he doesn't need it anymore. And then we have it freed up for these guys. Level clear. Fantastic. They have some Ninja Turtles on their floor. Was this a children's bedroom? Is this a familiar place? Have we been here before? I can't remember. Doesn't look familiar. But it also does at the same time. Maybe it's just because the textures are repeated, or the, the props or whatever are repeated. Um, yeah. I don't know. Hey, we passed with a C. Alright. This is the... He's still writing down everything. Hang on a second. Gotta go fetch another notepad. And by fetch another notepad, he means beat some skulls in. Or actually fetch another notepad. <laughs> Alright, gotta make sure there wasn't anything else I needed to grab. He's got a bath running so that after he's done with this, he can just go ahead straight in there. Looks like the sheets for the child's room has been taken off. And there aren't any Ninja Turtles laying around there. I guess his wife left him because he wasn't making any money. But they left all the, the gym badges over here. Okay, poor guy. Alright, I'm back. Continue. So... I'm in there, just waiting for the trial to start, and I can tell you, time moves slow when you're locked up. There's one day I get a visit. 
July 20th, 1990. So it's been like a year since that last bit. We're gonna call it here. It's gonna be a bit of a shorter one. Um, I just, I'm kind of running out of time. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.